I can't believe Bruce didn't even tell you he was looking into the court. The court was a difficult subject for Bruce. As a young child, he became convinced they were behind his pep. All right, Belfry, where am I headed? By cross-referencing the isotope in the key with Gotham architecture records, we've managed to narrow it down to a location. I'm sending you the coordinates now. Great. Thanks, Belfry. Belfry, I made it. Now to find that door. It will probably be well hidden. Remember the court rhyme. The Court of Owls is watching. From inside Gotham's walls. Got it. Might I suggest a quiet approach? If you're spotted, any files you plant will be suspect. I won't give them that chance. Here we go. Belfry, I'm in. Looks to be some sort of court hideout. It's empty. Strange location for it. Any indication of what they were doing there? Let me take a look.
Moreno. I remember that case. Belfry, can you call up the Moreno murder case? Should be in the unsolved file. Of course. The brother of Elena Moreno, a local judge. She took a leave of absence from the bench directly afterward for family reasons. It was a court of owls hit. Let me see what else I can find out. Belfry, looks like the court gave an order to purge at the Chelsea Tunnel. Construction on the tunnel was shut down when the site was declared unsafe. Sounds like a cover-up to me. Whatever is down there, the Court of Owls wants it kept hidden. I'll head there now. Take care, and keep us updated. I'm in. Looks like they hit some kind of underground tunnel. I'll probably lose comms down there. Mark my location. I'll check in as soon as I can. I'll wait for your update.
You've got to be kidding me. This place is huge. I wish you could see this, Belfry. The court's spending a lot of resources to mine whatever's down here. They already extracted what was in here. Extraction room. That sounds promising. No one around. 
Maybe now I can get a sample of whatever they're mining down here. Whatever they're mining down here, they must not be getting much of it. If I can extract a viable sample, we can analyze it back at the Belfry. get me out of here. your place. We earned our power. We shaped Gotham into the great city she is today. We are the protectors, not you. You're just bats. And I'll devour bats.
blocking the door. Probably debris from the cave-in. Not out of the woods yet. Please tell me that's a way out. Belfry, you there? We seem to have you back, Batgirl. Are you all right? I'm fine. The court is mining some strange substance, and it looks a hell of a lot like... <laughs> Belfry, you're cutting out. Belfry? You take forever to do the simplest of tasks. We have things to discuss. Come find me. Court of Owls is watching, from inside of Gotham's walls. They lurk in every shadow, and they rule you, one and all. You used us. You knew about the court and waited for us to do the dirty work for you. When I was still part of the League, we observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They call what they're mining Dionysium. But it looks like it's from a Lazarus pit. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. So those talons, that's what they're using to create them. So why not make a trade? A Lazarus pit for their science. You'd have a loyal army without ever recruiting another ninja. <laughs> Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus Pits. Of course, you get to use the Lazarus Pits because you're so generous and kind. Oh, those are some harsh words. I gave you back your friend, Jason. I knew it, and I know you didn't do it as some kind of favor to me. Or Bruce. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. He didn't ask for your help, Talia. None of us did. With Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. Just spit it out, Talia. You want the voice gone, and you want to use us to do it for you. But what do you get out of it? I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. Oh, now I get how Montoya feels.
Hey, Alfred, did the city records turn up anything? They didn't. According to the city permits, there's been no mining in Gotham City since the cauldron was completed. Judging from what we found last night, they've been digging down there for centuries. Give this a listen, Alfred. Babs managed to repair some of the court voice recordings. Dionysium brought the Talons back to life. Sort of. Dionysium's basically weak as hell Lazarus pit water. Brings back motor functions, but free will's as good as gone. So what is a Talon exactly? Some kind of feral zombie assassin? We've all seen weirder shit. Maybe. Feral zombie. Sounds like Jason, all right. <laughs> I recognize a voice. The older woman is Constance Cobblepot, I'm fairly certain. And the others? More difficult to say. Maybe if I heard them in person. In person? Tim, put the waveforms on the screen. It's hard to find a match with all the damage and voice modulation. Maybe the matching system would have better luck if- We match what we have against the live voices. Fun, but how do we find these jackasses? Two words, Orchard Hotel. The Masquerade, the event of the season. This year's dedicated to Master Bruce. Gotham's rich, dress up, and pretend they're humanitarians. I've been a few times. So it's Dirtbag Central. So many of Gotham's elite together, security at the Masquerade will be tight. Finding out their plans first would give you an important advantage. I'll tweak our masks to record telescopic audio. If we can get a good vantage point, we may be able to put some faces to these mystery voices. Sounds like our kind of party. There's new stuff on the board. Don't forget that you have a rendezvous with Mr. Hendricks. Acknowledge, Belfry.
some surveillance drones. Scan them and then you'll be able to fly here. They can't have gone far. We have multiple reports of suspicious activity. And that's Hendrix. We need officers near the Gotham Naval Research Facility. Hendrix has to be here somewhere.
I had a feeling this day was coming. You wouldn't believe the things that I heard at the hotel. The court probably wanted to make sure you didn't talk. Shit, they're real? That explains the masks. Look, one of my guys was feeding them info. And you know what? You should probably have all the same intel, too. Thanks. This is incredibly helpful. This city is going to the birds, I swear. Belfry, Hendrix is safe and sound. I have the data we need as well. Excellent. Please return to the Belfry so we can evaluate next steps. We're near the scene, dispatch. Have to move. I've uploaded the data we got from Hendrix. It should be ready soon. I've seen Bruce make that same face when he got stuck on a case. What's on your mind? Everything starts with Ra's al Ghul attacking Batman, but I, I can't figure out how it connects. You've never had to fight the League, have you? Raish is... was a fanatic. He formed the League of Shadows centuries ago to root out corruption all over the world. His philosophy, if you want to call it that, is that he should destroy things to build them back up. He's wiped out multiple cities over the centuries. He set his sights on Gotham. Batman stopped him. He was impressed. So he named Bruce his heir. That suddenly, even though Bruce said no thanks. But it meant Raish left Gotham alone. That is until he showed up. Bruce. Talia says Raish was behaving erratically when he died. Yeah. I put money on that not being the whole story. Hang on. What if our starting point is earlier? Batman died while he was investigating the Court of Owls. You think Raish found out about it? But why come after his heir? Raish cares about two things. Rooting out corruption and protecting the Lazarus Pits. So if the court was using an extract from the pits to create talents... Raish blows a gasket, steps in himself. Things escalate, both he and Bruce end up dead. And without Batman keeping a lid on Gotham's corruption, the court starts to stretch its wings. The League follows Raish to Gotham, and there's nobody to stop them from attacking the court. Gotham City becomes ground zero for a goddamn war. And no Batman to save it. I guess that's our job now. Yeah. It is. And we know what we need to do. We root out the court. And we keep the League away from Gotham. I really miss it. Excellent. The drive Mr. Hendricks provided us contains exactly what we need. I've set up a safe house for Mr. Hendricks. His original one was compromised, but he'll be all right now. Glad to hear it.